My name's Mena Clatworthy. Um, I'm the NIHR Cambridge BRC Training and Capacity and Development Lead. Uh, so about a year ago, uh, when I was at the annual Training Leads meeting, um, a number of issues were raised, including the fact that there were very few schemes to help non-medical healthcare professionals do research. And so we had some discussions back here in Cambridge and decided to try and set up a new scheme to support uh, non-medical healthcare professionals, including nurses, dietitians, physios, OTs, to be able to take the first steps in uh, doing some research. So we actually already have a scheme in place for clinicians, which we run uh, and is joint funded by the Addenbrooke's Charitable Trust. So we give them money to be able to work for a whole year to get research experience and preliminary data. And so myself and uh, Professor Christy Deaton, uh, who's the Professor of Nursing, set up some discussions with uh, the Addenbrooke's Charitable Trust, ACT, to see if we could um, start a similar scheme for non-medical healthcare professionals. So we were very pleased that uh, in 2014 we were able to launch that scheme. We had a number of applicants and successfully appointed um, uh, four candidates, so three nurses and one dietitian, and they've already started their research. So we really hope that um, by doing this that the individuals will be able to do a year-long project, uh, gain some experience of research that will allow them to get preliminary data to hopefully uh, put together a really competitive application for national PhD fellowships, including those provided by NIHR. And I guess our longer term vision is really to try and train a whole group of non-medical healthcare professionals that are able to take forward translational and patient-centred research in the NHS in the future. Well, Anne-Marie, I'm really excited that the Addenbrooke's Charitable Trust and the Cambridge Biomedical Res uh, Research Centre are funding fellowships for nurses, midwives, and AHPs, those people who are interested in uh, or applying for doctoral or postdoctoral fellowships. So these are internal research fellowships so that they've got time to really develop a competitive application. And I think it's important because it fits in with the strategic vision that you have, and maybe you could talk more about that. Yeah, absolutely, Christy. We're delighted to see this level of support and opportunity for our, for our staff. Um, our, our nursing strategy, our AHP strategy specifically, uh, whilst it obviously focuses on making sure that we've got compassionate and caring and excellent care, it's also about making sure that that care has an evidence base. And opportunities like this allow our nurses to um, apply and be part of the wider academic world and take this opportunity to add to the body of knowledge around nursing and improve practice, improve patient care. So I'm absolutely delighted that we're seeing these opportunities emerge. It is fantastic. I mean, we've said we want to be a world-leading centre for nursing midwifery and AHP yeah. research. And it, it fits very much with what we're doing at Cambridge University Hospitals with all the medical research yes. and the innovation that's going on. Yes. But the idea that we're, we're um, developing uh, our evidence base we, are, we want people at all levels to be interested in research, in reviewing the evidence, but also for people who, are, who do want to become investigators to have that opportunity to get funding to, to develop themselves. Yes, absolutely. And in addition to that, we're in a, an era where we're very um, challenged in terms of mm. finances and resources across the NHS. Having nurses and AHPs with this uh, with this level of academic understanding of, of research, of, of how we can make the, boat the best of the health resources that are available and apply them in the most and best evidence-based way, this will help to support the challenge that we face. It will also, I hope, be an opportunity to encourage nurses and AHPs to come and work here. It's a great um, attraction that we've got this very strong commitment to research, to education, to audit, to those things that add the additional components of what nursing is really all about. Well that's right, it's about supporting clinical academic careers, it's about enabling people to be the best that they can be as a part of, of delivering the best care that we can because research is not separate from clinical practice, mm -hmm. it is part of what we do as nurses, midwives. We, we have that, that um, professional obligation to practice according to the best evidence, but that also implies that we can review that evidence and maybe even create some of that evidence. Yeah. So we're very grateful to the Addenbrooke's Charitable Trust yeah. 
to the Cambridge Biomedical Research Centre for funding these fellowships. Yeah. And at the end of the day, the people who will benefit mostly from this are our patients, and that's what we're all here for. Absolutely. Thank you. Thank you.